Buenos dias, good afternoon, good evening, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel, wherever you are in the world, whenever you're watching this video, my name is Didi Tayutu. In today's video, I have a surprise for my wife. Yes, I tweeted today, if you would love to ask something at my wife, what would the question be? I thought we could like six or seven response, but we had like a lot of questions. So I took my wife here up to this beautiful rooftop terrace in Playa de Carmen in our penthouse. Yes, penthouse, Bitcoin penthouse. And and we are now going to jump to the table and ask those questions to my wife. She doesn't know yet. Now I think she knows, but let's see how she will respond to these questions, guys. Thanks all for asking these questions. Uh, and hopefully uh, you like the answers uh, and give the video at the end a thumbs up if you really like it. Bam! Bonjour. That was not a fart. That was this this yeah, cashew. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I have a small surprise. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> She's already camera getting is, <laughs> no the camera air. is set up. Everything yeah. is going to be on camera. Yeah, because you know I want to include my family more in the videos. And now I had this thing this morning, I had this thought. I posted a tweet. If you could ask something to my wife, what would it be? And now we have a list full of questions <laughs> and I want okay. to ask you the questions <laughs> uh, on camera so can we have a cool video but also that the people really understand um, what you thought when we went all in and all that stuff. Okay. Are you ready? Yeah, just hit me. Hit me. <laughs> no, with the questions. With the questions. With the questions. Okay, the first question was, was from Pornhub. Porn. Yes, oh, yeah. I, I, will, I will say the name, but it's not about porn. <laughs> no, no. Did she understand what you were doing or did she just put blind trust in you? No, no, he really explained to me and uh, we had several talks about what it was really about, Bitcoin trading and everything. So in the beginning I didn't know anything, but after we talked a little bit and uh, yeah, I know what I was, yeah, not all the way, but... <laughs> <laughs> I knew a little bit of what was coming. <laughs> okay. Second question, Ryan McTall Whopper. How often did you check the Bitcoin price after selling and going all in? Me? Yeah, it's a question to you. <laughs> Checking Bitcoin price? Never, she doesn't care. Yeah, sometimes <laughs> I ask you. Yes, I do. Yeah, but how much did you But check? only when the, you know, when I hear a lot of talk about Bitcoin, then I'm like, okay, there's something happening again, or it's dropping, or it's going up, then I'm interested. <laughs> would you have left me if Bitcoin would have failed? Well, I cannot... <laughs> she was thinking. No, yeah, because I don't know for sure. Now I would, I would say no, I would never leave you. But what if it really happens? You never know. Wow. Okay. It, it brings a lot of yeah, stress, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think. Yeah. So I don't know if we can cope with that. You don't know? If we go back We've been through a lot of stress already, <laughs> but you never know. Okay, so cool. Um, just keep it with no. I will not leave it. <laughs> <laughs> ah, yeah, fuck you now. Uh, why? Love you too. <laughs> love you too. Why you don't take a big loan to buy more Bitcoin? Huh? We are going to skip that question. Arthur, okay, you? I'm not loaning anything from anyone. Not banks, not people, not uh, nobody. <laughs> no. Arno Limpens is asking, how happy are you? One, happy, two, very happy, or three, extremely happy? Well, uh, I'm happy and sometimes I'm extremely happy, sometimes I'm very happy, sometimes I'm happy, you know, it's all like yeah, the psych circle of life, the cycle of life. It's just a normal woman. <laughs> with, <laughs> with hormones. Yeah. Uh, Four King Animals asking, how crazy did you think Didi was and how smart did you think he is? Well, I know he is crazy and smart. Yeah, I, you you grew a lot of, lot smarter the last couple of years. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you, you, I was a dumb motherfucker, <laughs> now I'm smart. That's no, what she no. wants to say. <laughs> you, all, you are always studying, you are always learning new stuff, so um, yeah. You keep on challenging. Oh, good save, so. good save. <laughs> so, Rini asked, did you trust Didi or did you trust Bitcoin? Trust Didi. I did. You know, I didn't know in the beginning uh, a lot 
lot about Bitcoin and um, I know it was there to change our life. So. Beautiful. North Sea Barbarian is asking, uh, oh no, she's saying it's so beautiful how uh, normal you stay. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Cardano Guru, was it her fate in you or Bitcoin? We already did that, uh, answered that. Um, how did you convince Didi to get off his nice, secure 9 to 5 job uh, and go all in and start living? Uh, well, that wasn't me, that was the circumstances of life that made him change his mind. Because yeah. I always tell him a lot of things and then he hears from somebody else or he learns a lesson through life and then he changes. Not because I say so, because he never listens really to me. She's lying. <laughs> <laughs> uh, does she think, this is Joe Wynn Bikes, does she think, does she think, if tides were turned, would you have listened to her about Bitcoin and going all in? Let's say you said, are we hey, going to go I all? get the question, I'm oh, not sorry. stupid. Um, what do I think? Well, I think I needed a lot of convincing, but yeah, I think he, he would. Blind. Blind, I trust her no, blind. No, you really <laughs> don't, yeah, okay. Um, <laughs> did you like, uh, Rodeweg is saying, did you like my wife not accept this at first and glad it happened later? What? No, his wife um, was not happy that he did it, but at the end she was happy, but I think it was the other way. Did you, like my wife, not accept this at first? I'm yeah. glad it happened yeah, later I, I after. loved the change that we made from the first step we did it. How did you feel during the 2018 beer market? I didn't feel that much. It was more like Diddy did. <laughs> Diddy is more like the uh, money Bitcoin man. And I'm like more like the, you know, I, I know you need money, but I'm not getting, um, disturbed or disrupted already when the market goes up or down now he's like oh yeah bitcoin is up more and i'm like yeah okay yeah. <laughs> i'm happy she said uh, then we have zypo oh, no, that's it that was a joke uh, I ha -ha. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> zypo I, um, I followed you in the media since i studied in germany in 2017 i wasn't in crypto and um, you're definitely a wise evolutionist in my opinion uh, the question for your wife would be what was her own opinion about Bitcoin? Uh, my opinion of, about Bitcoin is the revolution. That's the only thing for me what's Bitcoin really about. That's why I love her. I love her. Let's jump into the pool. Um, oh man, another question. Can you call his wife to convince her to go all in? No, sorry. Can I do that? for yourself and nobody convinced me I didn't no well, sorry. we can have a nice chat with his wife of course she can always talk with us and I can always give her my opinion but she needs, but she to, needs, make to, her own she needs to push the bottom of her side, the button um, is it a lot oh no is it there's a sus sus cr follow sus hi sus isn't it frustrating that a lot of people think you just follow your husband without thinking for yourself um, you did this as well, so respect to you. Yeah, and that's what uh, many people, uh, even family members, told me after a while. Uh, now I'm getting the feeling that you did it because you wanted to and not because Didi wanted to. So I'm like, yeah, everybody thinks their own and I don't care about it. I will just check if it's still recording. That would be great. Shit, I didn't record anything. April Fool's Day. Yeah. Okay. I know you for 27 years, so. <laughs> That's a long time, huh? <laughs> um, how in God's say no, this is Ed, Ed, Ed says, how in God's name did you say yes? <laughs> because I wanted to change already for several years. It took yes. Diddy longer than me. <laughs> to change life, yeah. <laughs> to um, change life. Yes. Dalo is saying, did you want to even little split up with him when he made that decision, ma'am? Yeah, like divorce me when I wanted to make that decision, but we made the decision to, uh, together. together. No, never crossed my mind. Esquandar is asking, how long did you take to make the final decision after Diddy told you about his plan of going all in? Oh, what would it be? Like two, 
three weeks that we talked about it. Yeah, about. Yeah. It took me a lot of Mai Tais and Bugatti Colts. Would you do it again? Yes. Would you also have done it without Bitcoin? To just sell and go? Suzanne is asking that. Well, uh, Bitcoin was for us the reason that we could do it. So, I, if there, yeah, it was <laughs> so I don't know if there, if it was called another name, <laughs> I would do it. It's not but without it's anything. Called. Just go take the bag of money and then start playing. Oh, like that? Like, yeah. Okay. Yes. But did he need uh, something, uh, a reason to go for, and that was Bitcoin. So, yeah. yeah. Good, but you're I, really I, good at this. I would already. You're not only beautiful, but also very Bitcoin. smart. <laughs> <laughs> um, when did uh, this is Ali B is asking this TC Ali B dot TC good name Ali B TC yeah. When did the uh, when did you switch the bottom and translate from Dutch to English? from unsecure to and doubt to what a genius move so till when did you think oh shit did we do the good thing and when was it like this was a genius move i am a genius well i never had so much doubt sometimes you know but i, I think everybody has this that you question your way of living is it still good what we are doing did we do the wrong thing but then I'm like you know it's not yeah yeah you, it's no need to think about it because so uh, you already did the change yeah. but I never um, yeah, we never doubt that it would go, go yeah, wrong no no Wait. we never doubt it sometimes we changed a little bit during our way and especially now I'm talking about with traveling with kids and the family stuff not so so much about that point oh, I think it, but I think it's also when Bitcoin went above 20k again, I think we got a little bit of a confirmation you. feeling. I got a little bit more <laughs> confirmation, okay, it was a good thing financially for my family, you know, that we took the, road, the, the right steps. You never know, but good question. Thanks. No, and even now with the, um, what all, what all the changes that are happening in the world, I believe it's a good thing what we did with the kids, with the school system and um, the traveling thing. So. That's the next question. Oh, sorry. Crypto Chris, mm -hmm. and he's asking, would you not rather go back to a stable life uh, with a f house and everything normal? Um, no, uh, I don't want. I don't want what I had because I wanted to change it. But what I'm telling Didi often is like I would maybe have somewhere like kind of a base where we can go back to where the kids feel a little bit more like home and and uh, you have your uh, maybe a home feeling I do, you, do you consider the blockchain villages that i'm building as a base could be could be okay yeah i need to see it before i believe it la vie <laughs> un crypto is asking how did you feel about the rest of the enslaved society uh, i let everyone be and that's why I hope everybody lets me be. <laughs> so, <laughs> to be or not to be, Bitcoin. <laughs> um, were you never scared? Is Johan asking? Scared? No. No, I'm thinking. Was I ever scared? Yeah, you need to answer. Yeah, maybe I talked to you about it, but I cannot recall that I, I've been scared. No, because there is always a solution, I believe. There is this virtual world, world it's called Decentraland, and they have a Santa. His name is Decentraland Santa. Ho, ho, ho! Santa, S-A-N-T-A. S-A-N-T-A. Santa. Okay, okay. Ho, ho, ho! Is it going to be a Merry Christmas? My question is, what does she want for Christmas? Wow. Christmas. I'm not like uh, the person that wants to get presents. It's for me, you know, I hate like birthdays and Valentine's You don't want anything Day for Christmas? That's noted. I don't need to buy anything for Christmas. No, it's always, you know, <laughs> it's always good to get a present, but it's hard for me like, yeah, what? no, I don't need really stuff. I don't okay. know. I, no, I, nothing coming to my mind now. Sorry. So you will answer, no, no, no. <laughs> but. Andre Britz is asking, I know, or is saying, 
I know you didn't want to do it, but what was at the end the decisive thing that changed your mind to do it? So he's saying that you didn't want to do it. I wanted to do it. Just do it. Just do it. Just do it. Um, Liberty PTC is asking, what advice to an average low mid-income housewife like mine yeah. or working wives or mothers would you give? Oh. Just in this short video. Yeah, just a short advice. Okay, a Doesn't short advice. Okay, what I've learned uh, the last couple of five years, really, it's maybe not believable, but everything is possible. If you leave it open. If you are like, I want it to be like this, and I want to achieve that like in this way, then probably it isn't possible. But if you go with the flow, and if sometimes it's is different than you want it to be at the end it's possible good 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 answer man you're, you're so yeah maybe it's a little bit too open i don't know but for me it's like you know uh, many people are asking you know you do uh, can you go to spain from portugal with the borders closed and you know the small things that people doubt and that's why they don't do anything but if you do it you see you will get from portugal to spain and away Everything and it was an easy way most of the times that's the crazy part it's easy cool. so you talk more than me now right you always say did you talk too much and now that <laughs> i want to keep the video short and now and you're you talking keep, so much you are you keep next shot. question sorgfrey <laughs> he's asking or she's asking what was your biggest impact or change in your life and how did you adapt or cope with it the change was uh, letting go of my um <laughs> yeah, I, I was searching for the name. Structure. I like structure. I still do. Uh, but with my family of uh, three daughters and one husband, they are all like uh, the same. Yeah, I need to let go of a lot of structure and it made it easier for me, but still, sometimes I just like structure. <laughs> I need it. It keeps you grounded. Yeah. And I need to be grounded. <laughs> Stefan is asking, at what price did you go all in? He just asking that and saying, I started at 500. He started at 500, we started at 800, and we ended at 6,000 US dollar. Oh shit, you should have answered. Yeah. yeah same answer. <laughs> <laughs> More Bon Channel is saying, what did you really feel the first time your husband told you about selling everything? What was your real feeling? Uh, first see it, then believe it. Yeah, because I yeah, she didn't believe that I was up to selling all my luxury. No, but stuff. you talk a lot, so it's yeah. like I first need to see it and then I believe it. But you that's see? with everything. That's how she is. Huh? <laughs> I'm married to this, huh? Mr. Jello, yellow, yellow is asking Lambo or Ferrari. Lambo. Lambo girl. <laughs> Octo Bitcoin is asking, what color did you have in mind for your first Lambo? And did it change along the way? For me? <laughs> yeah. Well, I never had a Lambo in mind, but if I need to choose, my favorite color is purple. <laughs> so, sorry. <laughs> purple yeah. ring. Alulu is asking, did you trust your decision to sell and buy Bitcoin or did you have the research? <laughs> sorry. Well, <laughs> now you, we already answered that question. Yeah. And so, it's, <laughs> it was a decision we made both. Uh, would you do it now again with the Bitcoin price and the whole world situation I think that he means Aryan is asking about. Yeah, if that would be again the reason to change our life, yes I would. Okay, um, that were all the questions. Ta -da. Bam! Ta -da. I hope you really like my wife answering Romain and the questions. <laughs> if you did like this video, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and family, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, please leave a comment and we love to she is really going to respond to the comments now because she answered the questions she is going to get the response i really like this maybe yeah. the next tweet should be about the kids what would they want to ask my oldest daughter keep looking at my twitter account because i will do another tweet about another family member is there anything you want to say at the end of this video to the people well i really like answering the questions normally i'm not like the camera kind of girl but um yeah i really like it this time so if you have questions I can try to answer. Right. <laughs> yes. And uh, are you going to promise that you're going to do more videos with me? Uh, I don't do promises. <laughs>
it because then I need it's to It's always the them. same with women. Are we going to have sex tonight? Yeah, probably. Bam! That was the promise. Okay, I'm going to uh, remind you always, guys, to zoom out in Bitcoin and try to zoom in the life. Try to enjoy every single minute of the day as that is exactly what life should be about. And if you decide to go all into Bitcoin, yes, it is a little bit more easy to live life with a beautiful view like here in Mexico, Playa del Carmen. Can I have a little small kiss? Do you still love me? Yes, I do. I love you too. <laughs> Bye! <laughs>